Hi there, this is Buddy OG from Unreal Keyboards with part two on how to lube your stabilizers for Real Force and Happy Acting Keyboards Topra. So, the first part what focused on the space bar, and here we have the other stabilizers. It has a housing. Uh, if it's a Happy Acting Keyboard, the housing is, is built into it, it's built into the shell. <coughs> what you need is some sort of tool to remove the bar. I, I prefer this, I fix it, Jimmy comes with, they have a good uh, kit, no sponsor, but it's a good tool. The secret here is having to fill as much as possible without allowing it to contact the outside of the slider. The outside of the slider contacts the inside of this housing. This is very thick grease. Very thick grease on a sliding component was going to change the key feel. All we're trying to do is silence the slider or the, the stabilizer bar. This slider has a shelf that you can only access while it's disassembled. So I put with a grade two. two this is a grade two uh, grease. You have to avoid any silicone based greases or it will damage the toper domes. So 206 and a syringe, very important to not, not get it anywhere that would be uh, liable to change the key feel at all. We're just putting enough in here where the bar acts on it. We don't want it to overflow. We don't want that much. I mean, this is a, this is about as much as we want. Now, put the slider back in. I'm not I'm not sure if this 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 uh, is really does anything, but for good measure. Where the bar acts on the on the housing, you can you can place the grease on the inside too. But the bar is going to snap in here. Finally, fill where the bar this elbow axe fill it but do not get it on the sliders again that's why we're using syringe you can let it overflow we're gonna we're gonna take care of that fill fill this entire this entire bit okay now you don't want the grease contacting the pcb or the landing pad if you install it so wipe that off clean now you have a finalized stabilizer bar